Hello my bits Togat and this is episode 9 of the Dragon Ball Adventures and in this episode we're going to explore Farajabajar, I can't pronounce it, um, <laughs> and then I think we're also going to get back to the wizard's quest line because uh, I, he's got to have something to do with all the things because there's one out right outside his house uh, and the closest thing to it, there's one outside the Skull Village, the one outside uh, Raven Rock and there's one outside his house, he looks like the guy most likely to be behind it since he's uh, he's always like yeah people should do it for stuff for me, so I think if we do his quest line maybe he will open up to me and we'll be uh, we'll become good friends and plus he has some pretty good dialogue anyway so it'll be a fun time but first of all we're gonna uh, just uh, see what this place is all about clear it because uh, I haven't cleared a dungeon in this uh, place yet uh, which is a little embarrassing uh, it looks like now the guys start getting slightly this isn't really strong this is uh you know lots of damage taken uh, oh heavy armor increased I don't oh wait whoa 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 no 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 heal <laughs> uh, yeah uh, stay uh, I don't know what heavy armor oh it must be my hair helmet so just from the helmet alone, I'm managing to level up heavy armor. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with that. I mean, it's pretty slow, I guarantee. Ooh, one hit. One already one hit. Final hit. Uh, just quickly check the bodies, get some gold, because uh, saving up for that house, uh, that really good house. Uh. So yeah, this is apparently a sideways dungeon. Uh, I guess I can deal with that. Uh, it probably won't be too long to, comp well, not to compensate, but just because, you know, having a dungeon being really long and sideways, uh, or some quickly gets candlelight out. Do I have it saved to my thing? No, I don't. Um, don't need it anyway. Uh, I can just... Oh, night vision. Uh, I think it's a power. Uh, which means I wouldn't need to... Wait, is it power? Yeah, it's power. Just turn on night eye. Uh, quickly turn it on now. And bam. Now everything's super... Uh, it's a, it makes everything a little duller. I like the colours. Oh, look, you can see Skyrim from here. Um, I admit it makes the colours slightly more dull. Uh, but what is this? Whoa, it's a robot, and it has like, whoa. <laughs> How am I fighting a robot in Skyrim? This is this is why things don't make sense. But yeah, let's get back to killing him then. Uh, so bow. Oh wow. Yeah, I, I think I've. Whoa, he's he's giving me loads of levels as well. So not not too bad for a fight. Uh, let's quickly check the body. Um, Greater soul gem, not going to take the metal. I don't know why he has a soul gem on it as well, but, you know, these are all questions we don't really need to ask. Uh, activate. Oh, it opens and closes the door. So maybe there's one for this door? No, oh, whatever. I'll just keep going for the dungeon, seeing seeing what there is. So, uh, crazy tall light thing. Uh, okay, we've got, we've got a Kriegling hunter. I can't... I don't, I don't think I killed this dude, so... Oh, I can just turn night on I every time it goes out. So let's let's. There's just there's just a lot of buttons, and they do a lot of things, I guess. Oh wow! Oh oh, really? They're that fast killing? I guess don't run into propeller blades. That's that's the key takeaway from this uh, experience. Don't don't run into propeller blades. They they kill you. <laughs> um, so let's see what this shield is all about. Let's see what's on the other side. Okay, it's just a shield uh, with some fans. I guess I'm outside. Oh no, I'm inside again. Uh, is this before I killed the first dude though? So let's get we have to kill him again. Uh, super hit, and now just keep hitting him over and over again. Uh, I think I have to heal in between this point somewhere, so I'll just get ready to do that. Um, oh, this see, look, this is fast. Uh, where's the second guy? Oh, here's, here he is. Uh, see, no healing needed. Just uh, powering through it, and I think healing is needed. Never mind. Um, <laughs> They actually are pretty powerful, they just not they just don't seem to get hits dumb when I'm hitting them. Which I guess makes sense. Oh I'm gonna get all the Ooh, bam. Yay. Um Not gonna bother looting them this time. I can never be able to do something twice. Ooh, is this oh that's just the exit. Um Is there anything to the right? Because I did so oh no, it's nothing. I, I always get confused as to whether I'm actually going for a linear dungeon or if it's like multi blended that I just chose the right decision the right time. Um and that might seem like a strange thing to get confused about, but you know, I, I, I like I trust my skills enough to believe in that. Uh, so I guess I've out. What was that? Oh, it's those. Uh, fair enough. Shouldn't have trimmed that. Uh, I really shouldn't have done it the second time anyway. Uh, so oh, here, here's the guy again. Pretty quite the robot. This time he's fully formed, which is. Uh, I guess I awoke him by. Oh, can we get him before he kills me? Uh, can we? I think we can. Boom. And does he have the same stuff on as... Oh, no, he has... Yeah, he has completely different stuff. Um, it's quite interesting how that works. I guess it's random drop... Well, it's not random, but it's a uh, system of drop tables. 
so this time, just because I don't want to do it a third time, I'm just going to save it just in case, because uh, I have a habit of dying to propeller blades. That was the most random death I've ever had. Um, also, just quickly put Night Eye on while we're at it. Um, powers Night Eye. Uh, it's now quickly turned into Night Eye mode. Uh, let's just touch that button this time. Okay, that turns on foul, fire. Uh, let's turn that one off. Okay, apparently turn. Okay, I turned it off. Uh, it's like a roulette of like things, I guess. Um, none of which being particularly good. Uh, so now I've got to go to another door, but it's sh it's just a regular door, so it should be simple enough. Oh bam! <laughs> See, I'm good at oh. That's awkward. Um, lots of dream of dream of metal, but none of it being what I want. Uh, so I guess I have to find the one that turns on this door and doesn't kill me. Uh, so I've tried the bottom... Okay, let's try the bottom in between the bottom left and right. One of these is going to kill me. That much, I know for a fact. I think that was the door. Yay! I don't have to die. Please don't tell me I need the second one as well. Maybe there's something in here. Um, this is a pretty cool dungeon. I'm liking it. Um... So on the wall we've got some light, but that's because I've got night eye on. Will he turn it on again? Um, also, sort of, I'm ruining the colours with like, night eye, but I figure it's better than not being able to see it all. Uh, so that's why I went. Oh, there's just a door. How did I miss the door? Oh wow. Um, maybe this is the way through the dungeon from now. Oh, what's that? I don't trust things in dungeons. Let's look around carefully. Uh, there's a door. Leads you down a stair. It's not really a staircase. It's just overlooking something. Uh, so I guess I have to. This maybe? Unlock chest expert. Why not? I I like a challenge of a chest. Oh, oops. Um. Oh bam. <laughs> I love how lucky I get when I guess. Um so gold, minor magicka. And I'll take it. Does that help the door be open? No it doesn't. Uh maybe on the left? No. Uh, there's there's gonna be a button around here somewhere. I'm just, not really too worried about it. And plus there's two doors. Well, this this is more of a door. That's just more of a look through the door and see what else is in the dungeon sort of thing. Um, quickly check this thing. Okay, that's just a spinning thing. Uh, what's over here? No. There's going to there's be a button around here somewhere. I'm just missing it. Uh, checking the walls carefully. Oh, maybe there isn't a button. And maybe it's in the earlier room and I have to press more buttons and hopefully not die. Uh, I... Oh wait, maybe it's something to do with this. I don't have any wind spells, so I can't really do anything about that. I have the, uh, I forget what it's called, the the one where you make them go flying, which I think it's, oh, Fisro Dar. Um, I've never been a big fan of saying Fisro Dar, because it's just like, uh, I don't. Um, <laughs> maybe that's just me. I'm just going to turn them all at once. What's the worst that can happen, right? Oh, that's the worst that can happen. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm going to avoid that propeller blade, like, I don't know, just just to be safe. Yeah, those, those things are insta-kill, so I'll quickly just walk around it. Uh, there's an electric spider here, uh, I could walk him through the blade, but I'll just I'll just kill him the natural way. Um, I'm really confused as to how they have, I don't know, robots in the past, whatever. Oh, it's not really the past, by the way, just... To, in case you're not aware. Uh, so this isn't actually a door, by the way. That is actually just a, a gate thing. Uh, maybe the button is over here somewhere, though. For the next thing. No, this is just another pile of ruins. Because um, uh, there's got to be a, there's got to be a way to open the door. They won't just have a not openable door. Uh, maybe I did it just then. No. I guess it would be backwards thinking to make you go back to open a door. Uh, I, I've just got to be missing the button. It's just a matter of where is this button I'm missing. Um, can I get... no? Oh, wait, what? Nope, you can't get through here. Logically speaking, that doesn't even make sense. Um, <laughs> there's, there's there's a button somewhere. I'm just missing it. Where, Where's this button? Maybe I can Maybe I can literally just walk up to it and press open door. Nope. Just checking that one now, because if I find that out later, it's a bit embarrassing. In fact, it's embarrassing if I found it out now. But it gets less, more embarrassing the longer I go about working it out. Um, yeah, I, I can't seem to find out what I'm doing here. Uh, oh, what's what's that? 
Okay, I, d I don't know. I, I really like this dungeon, but I guess I, I just I can't do it. <laughs> I pressed every single button. Um, now I have to press them all again because I don't know which one does it. Oh, oh, whatever. It's been that way. Um, I guess we're heading back into the open world of Skyrim. Um, this was a nice dungeon. It was a shame about the spinning blades. <laughs> uh, so now I have to work out which one opens this door again. Which means pressing them all look over again. Oh, is the one on the far left? Um, so I guess I'm leaving. Uh, at least I didn't. What's this button do? Oh. See, I there's got to be. Oh, uh, you know, let's just. I it was a good it was a good attempt at the dungeon, but it's close. But no, actually, there's probably a lot more to the dungeon. Uh, close, but no cigar is uh, how I'm looking at this one. Um, so let's go quickly do the quest of the wizard because I wanna wanna see his witty dialogue. Uh, honestly, I uh, uh, someone in the comments will tell me what the what I did wrong, uh, and if you know what what I was meant to do, just leave an idea because I have no idea. I give it some time, but I think it'd be less annoying if I left. And like, there's there's a point where it's like I'm not gonna spend 20 minutes just trying to work this out, and uh, don't wanna look it up because that goes against my gaming principles. So uh, yeah. Uh, this this dude looks pretty cool. Just uh, chin there in his gold armor, uh, with his crazy sword and his uh, nice leg plates, and his uh, his uh, he's wearing a cloth around his leg plates. So it doesn't feel like it'd add that much protection, but what do I know? This this guy knows more than me, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna guarantee this wizard quest line. I'll even get the key to the door. He'll either open the door or something. Like maybe that'll be my enchanting room where I can be as apprentice or something. So I'm doing lots of tasks for him, and uh, I don't know. I just I just want to do one of the two things. Um, in fact, I'm getting quests done, which I think counts towards. Wait, actually, what? One sec. I forgot the achievements, so I'm just gonna really look them up, see if they're all quest based or what. Because uh, achievements are fun things to go for. Uh, Tame ride five dragons, house and well, thirty. Ooh, that's one I can do. How um, many? I'm probably close to that now. Uh, secret. Oh, there's five black books. Ooh. Craft an ultimate of Starrim. I need to go mining for that. Three plots of land. That actually would probably be... Yeah, these are... Okay, Temple of Marak. Uh, some of... Okay, so some quest ones. Then three words for dragon aspect. Uh, five black books. Craft now. Okay, so I can... Okay, that's fair enough. Oh, whoa, what? Did you see how glitchy that just went? Um, so somewhere around here, according to the quest anyway, I'm going to find Verona. Uh, there's no quest icon for it. So I just have to... Oh, she could be at the stone! And uh, maybe... Well, that, that'd mean he wasn't in control of it. Because uh, she has been missing, and the stone is very close. I might... I think I might have murdered all the people at the stone. Not not to be awkward about it or anything. But... Actually, this... No, I haven't murdered everyone at this one. Uh, I have, uh, I'm pleased to report that everyone here is hopefully alive. Um, might be pissy with me still. Because... Uh, Let's wait a few hours, uh, 12 hours. I, I, I want to be able to sprint. It's just uh, it's a natural desire to want to go faster in games. So, uh, let's quickly uh, just wait for the sprinting things to happen. Uh, do, 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 do. Um, it takes wait. I, I, I don't know if this is a good thing or a bad thing, but it takes a very long time to uh, wait. Which I guess makes sense, because waiting takes a, a very, very long time. Uh, I don't know. Just, uh, just saying words out there again. Um... Just quickly, just to uh, get my thing back up. Uh, so <laughs> that sounds a bit uh, strange by itself, but yeah. Um, what are you? Ah, oh, god damn it! See, killing them doesn't help. Uh, Verona, Reva. Oh, they all just called Reva and Reva Outlaw. Reva Outlaw. One of these is probably called Verona. Hopefully, it's a pretty cool guess if I got this right, but it doesn't look like I am right. We'll just take this with me as well. Uh, yeah, I'm. None of these people are called Verona, so I guess she's just around the house somewhere, just like yeah, I'm scared because uh, I'm I'm a woman and I don't want to make tea for no man. Um, <laughs> that was an awful, awful voice. If I don't even know what I was doing. Um, but yeah, so ooh. Oh, I, I keep thinking it's an ore and being like, wait, creep, and then it's like harvest, I'm like, Wah, why, um, that's just the pains of being toy cat these days, you have to, you have to say words, and then your words mean some things to people, and, uh, you know, let's check this third house out then, uh, 
what's she called again? Verona. So, if we check out uh, the Mifflin Tell Mifflin Kitchen, then maybe we'll find the secrets to. Uh, I don't know what secrets we're looking for, but we'll find the secrets to. Um, we'll find some secrets. We'll, we'll definitely find some secrets. Um, so, quick search the chest. Uh, get some gold. Black robes, don't need him. Uh, so she's not in here. She's not in the kitchen. That means she's doing something wrong right there. I'm not going to make more internet sexism jokes. Um, but she's definitely not in the kitchen. I mean, that's the logical first place to look for a woman. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm so clever. I make I make sexist jokes on the internet. Uh, everyone should come follow me because I'm so cool to make. Uh, but, <laughs> but yeah, that's, uh, let's actually find her. Um, this, is there four houses? Or f there's four. Oh no, there's... Whoa, there is as well. Is that the one I was just in, or is... I have no idea. Um, she's in one of these houses, it's just a matter of which one. Uh, this one, maybe? Apothecary. We'll see if she's seen Verona, and... Uh, or she'll give me some hints if she has, or hasn't, or... She'll say something, she'll say something. Because there is a woman in here, I might have already murdered her. Uh, based on the lack of people here, I'm going to assume I murdered her. Oops. Uh, actually, it's a bit late. Eh, 8.35's not late in my eyes. Um, if it's late in hers, then she's doing something wrong. That's just uh, my opinion there. Uh, um, so, nothing there. So, where is this Verona young lassie? Um, I guess I could ask for some hints if I... Okay, so this one is this uh, is that guy's. Uh, so, I'm guessing this one is someone else's. Is this the kitchen again? No, this is the steward's house. I'm assuming that is Verona. We'll look around, we'll find like a blood stain and a body, and I'll be like, ooh, I should I should probably tell him about this. Um, that's my assumption anyway. Okay, just a bed. Oh, I can sleep in it though. Um, there's a benefit. Oh, you get a yellow, um, you get a 10% experience bonus when you sleep. It's probably 5, I think it's 5% when you sleep in a bed that's not owned by you, but it's, it's a nice thought. Uh, Death Brand, let's read this quickly. You can read it if you... Oh, this is the same book from earlier. If you want to read this book, just uh, pause every other page and uh, do it that way. Uh, Alright, I like to have a little bit of uh, interactivity. It's not really interactivity, but you can read a book if you want to. Uh, so, sleep bed. Let's... 12 hours. We'll, we'll start nice and early tomorrow. Uh, it'll be annoying not being able to... You know, I want to do it at night, actually. I'd rather sprint than have her be fed to me on a silver platter. Uh, that's not really how it works. But in my mind, it is... Uh, it's all that counts. It's all that counts. Um, yeah, we're going to have to go ask for tips because there is no one here. And I don't even remember murdering anyone. So, I don't know. There's, there's definitely a big quest line going along on a lot around here. Uh, also, I checked my Heartstone because I mined a second one. It's worth 100 gold, so that could be a pretty good way to make money. Uh, it's probably an ore, a bar to be made out of it. So, let's just open Tail Mithrin. Um, so, yeah, just uh, that's, that's probably something I might do at some point in the the game in the world in the I have no idea um, but smoke and black background and okay so we'll just quickly go up this thing if you haven't seen it's quite cool it, you, you jump and you just go flying it's like wee <laughs> I know I like it uh, so we'll, we'll speak to his assistant see what he has to say um, Need something. have you seen Verona Ask oh she and Verona seem where's Elena oh why did you just get fired at you know, I'll just pull you speak to this dude, say I haven't seen him anywhere. Uh, Have you found do you need help with your research? I suppose that depends. Oh, yeah, of it course. Should provide an additional you would experience it as a sort of... Okay. At least I think it will. Okay, I'll be glad to help. Still. It's my first oh, time yay. And I don't need any additional distractions. Okay, where am I standing still? But if you do... Not to <laughs> <laughs> See, I like this guy. Let's keep doing quests for him. Okay, fair enough. Let's quickly experiment with the subject. That's fun. I wonder if he just keeps doing this until I, you know... Ooh. I want that. I'll just uh, uninchart on that quickly. Uh, oh. Bam. Uh... We'll put that on my bow. Actually, I don't think that makes sense. But we'll put... Should we put stamina damage? Okay, there's nothing else I can put on here. Uh, so we'll, we'll put shock damage on there. Uh, yeah, why not? Uh, we need to kill stuff anyway. Common soul gem. Bam! Enchanting level increase? Yep. 41. Uh, Enchanting is one of the easiest skills to increase if you have money to spend. But there's quite a few skills you can increase quite easily. So, uh, I don't know, just uh, words, for the, words for people. Um... 
I wanna open this door. Why can I not? What is in there that it's so valuable? It's got an enchanter and can en a, a arcane enchanter. Oh, there's a throne in there. Is that a throne? I don't know. A uh, table, maybe. Um, but yeah, let's just uh, let's go head off and uh, help with the quest. Uh, we've got to speak to... Wait, let's see if the thing updated the quest. Uh, she's... I, I don't know where she could be. Also, you have to... You can't jump down there. You have to go down the regular way or some bad stuff happens. Um, I guess I'll get the test subject thing done while I do this. Uh, I'd, I'd imagine it's going to... I don't think it's going to be good. Just, uh, it wouldn't give me a quest for it if it was going to be good. Uh, or it might do, just to throw me off to make me think this, because, uh, you know, it's it's definitely made me think. Um, also, where would all these people be? Like, where did they go to sleep? Uh, maybe, I'll, I'll check behind the mushroom, because I haven't actually seen behind there yet. There might be more, like, houses and stuff. Um, or, you know, places to go. Um, yeah, this is a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool little mushroom uh, house thing. Uh, definitely a big fan of this dude and his uh, his magical ways. Uh, looks like he has a boat port. Oh wait, what's this? Oh no. Thought I saw something. Um, also thought this was a boat port. I don't know. Oh wait, yeah it is. If you go down here. then admit. No, it's just a fortification against the sea thing. So, um, yeah, this is, this is a lovely, lovely house he has. Um, not that I'm going to let him know that. Um, I could definitely see myself murdering him and having his house at some point, so... Hopefully they give me the options to do that, because, uh, you know, I'm, I'm definitely a big fan of this house, and I don't think he appreciates it as much as I do. Uh, so we'll wait for daytime, I know I can't sprint, but so what I'm going to have to, you know, sacrifice, so I'm going to do this quest, uh, and then she'll hopefully, or at least her friend will show up, and she'll be like, yeah, I haven't seen her, but I think she went over to that sunstone thing. And then I'll ask about sunstone, she'll be like, I don't know why it's there, actually, is it, is it yeah, this is sunstone. 9.01pm, uh, that's AM, sorry, 10.01? Okay, 11.01. Uh, ooh, really? Ah, uh, stop doing that to me. Uh, so now I have to go fix that, which really sort of sucks. Um, <laughs> so I, um, so I hope you have enjoyed this episode of the Skyrim Adventures. Um, I could just go murder people anyway, because, uh, Let's face it, I was gonna do it anyway, and I still probably will. So it's just a matter of... Wait, can I still sprint if I... Is it early enough for me to sprint still? No, it's not, so... Yeah, I, I don't know what to do anymore. I have to go kill someone. So I'll see you next time after I've murdered someone. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed the uh, the episode and the series so far. Uh, if you have, you should leave a like rating because it lets me know that you liked the video and the series and all the all the fun things I just said. So uh, thanks for watching the video and goodbye.